Oh, hello. Oh my god, they're all there. Oh, okay, let's just ult to buy some time. <laughs> I thought it was just clean to do. I just blinked into four people. I don't think it matters, though. Like, I, I am King Arthur with 50% cooldown. What do you do, really? I'm still so tanky as well. Dude, can I get another... I can get another roll off here, right? Yeah, I did. Two ults in, like, how many seconds? Today, we become legends. Hey, my name's Inter, welcome back to Inter Games, and today we're going to be doing some King Arthur solo. I'm finally doing it, we're going to be doing some Bauble build action. I know I'm milking the Bauble buff harder than I milked your mom, but uh, it's, it's basically, it's, just, it's a lot of fun to try out, you know. They've made the big buff to it, it's actually usable now. And I feel like King Arthur's got to be one of the better users of it, right? Like, 50% uh, cooldown on all these abilities, that's got to be good, right? Uh, I think the plan this game is Glad Shield Prophetic Pribwin, uh, for my 40% cooldown, and then Bauble, of course. Uh, we may run into tankiness issues, but I'm going to be going Prophetic, so hopefully that should aid us a little bit in that. Prophetic, obviously, the single best tank item in the game once you get it stacked up. Uh, we could have rushed it, but I feel like uh, Glad Shield's just too important for King Arthur, right? Well, we want that Glad Shield online now to start stacking Prophetic a little bit later. Thing is, if you rush Prophetic in the laning phase anyway, you just end up um, capping out on physical stacks before you leave the lane, like, anyway, so it doesn't really matter, like... Yeah, you're already at 15, like, well before you would leave the lane and start getting magical stacks from, like, their mid laner and support and stuff, so... It's probably fine to go Prophetic second, I think. And Glad Shield would be a lot better for the laning phase for us. Why is this Shiver so dead? What? Let's see if we can spin on him, group up the wave a little bit. Yeah, I don't know what happened, uh, he's... Did not have a fun time on his buffs, apparently. Is Shiver's clear really that bad? Maybe it is, dude. I've not played Shiver in time. Outside of Assault, I don't think I've uh, actually picked Shiver since this release, dude. What a boring god. Let's clear that out real quick and get on some totem action. Yeah, dude, I don't know how I feel about, like, the, the stars and Smite. It's this very hot topic. A lot of people say, like, the pulling buffs around is, like, a really really trash way to start the game. Uh, like, I do kind of agree to a certain extent, because it does mean certain picks just like this guy. I mean, it, it may have been a skill issue on his part. Shiver's clear might not be that bad, but the fact that you just come into lane with this much health is really nothing you can do. I mean, granted, I'm King Arthur on the first few waves. Like, I'm, I'm gonna win those trades anyway, but it does make some characters, like, really difficult to play. Just because you lose so much pressure in the early laning phase because of the amount of damage you take and how slow you are at clearing and stuff. In Smite 2, you start in lane, though, uh, from what I've been seeing, so maybe that'll uh, help that out a little bit. Oh, a Comet, lovely. Unfortunately, Arthur's real trash at taking Comets, but we have so much pressure right now that it does not really matter. I'm kind of tempted to level my 3 here, but I probably won't. It does have knock-up immunity, so if I'm just spinning on him, he, he can't really do too much about it, but he can dash away from it, so... Careful left. I should be okay, honestly. I'm not really too worried about the cleaner ganking me. Also, Shiva's backing, so I highly doubt she is. Yeah, she's on big camp, so fine. Oh, they get her as well, nice. Dude, I've got so much gold already. I can almost afford full Glad Shield at three minutes in. That's kind of crazy. I think I've got to do my blue here. Could even do back camps? Ah, uh, Najat probably wants to come over and do those. I want to steal this farm. I feel like I probably could have done those, though. Like, they've got mid camps up to do. They've got red and speed. I probably could have just done back camps there. I don't think Najat's going to be there, like, anytime soon. I lied. He's, he's going for him now. <laughs> I think he was coming over to leech a bit of my blue buff, though. Okay, I don't know where Shiva's going. Probably to his own blue. Yeah, this build should be pretty sick late game, dude. I think the one issue we're going to have is I'm not going to be that tanky, but... With the 50% cooldown, does it matter? I can maybe just, like, use my mobility for tankiness. Like, mobility is kind of tankiness, right? You dodge abilities. Let's see if we can get this. Yeah, dude, this scepter's done work for me. I've been at a farm so effectively since that came down. It's gonna wear off now, but we can get full glad shield when I back and probably upgrade my TP as well. I have my ult, dude. This guy should be a little bit scared of me right now. 
Might get some bursts on him. Probably not gonna be a kill, but. There we go. Burn his ult. Uh, his TP should be down. I think he used it a little bit ago, so we can just back, get Glad Shield TP back in and pressure out here. Maybe grab a ward or something just in case Kalina's gonna try and shut me down in this lane. We are getting a big lead here. I'm already 500 gold up. Okay, he's backing. I guess we just shove this in a tower, right? Yeah, we'll level the one. I was thinking maybe leveling the three. It, it could be good, honestly, in this matchup. He doesn't really have a way to stop it. He could dash away from it, but he doesn't have a way to stop it. And uh, the, the three in combo sounds chunks hard, dude. If uh, no one has a way to interrupt it. Okay, he lost most of a wave there, which is very nice for me. Spin on him to group up the wave. Oh, dude, he's taking some damage. Get the knock-up, maybe, into the ult. Maybe we shard here, actually. Maybe I can kill. Do this. Do this. Oh, almost, dude. Almost. He's got a tier 2 breastplate online, dude. He's a little bit tankier than he was before. But he's having to back again. Najja might be looking for a blue in bed. I'll just call that. I think he was looking for the kill. Yeah, we probably could invade blue, honestly. I'm a little bit low on mana, though. Kind of spammed there to uh, force out the shiver. Maybe just go do my own blue. I think his is slightly delayed from mine. Actually, we'll just get a bit of totem action and clear out one more way before we go for blue. Speaking of, let's get some more totem action. Dude, there's so much to do in solo nowadays. I like it. Like, I like having a lot of uh, stuff to fight over and uh, encourage aggression in the lane and stuff, but uh, there's so much to do. Feels like I never got a chance to do my blue, but... Yeah, like, the way he's coming back in now, the uh, scorpion thingy with jig is spawning, the naga, if I can say that word on YouTube. Um, but, like, you never seem to get a chance to do your blue. Oh, really? Lifesteal totem is all we have? Uh, I can't be bothered going to do uh, back camps to get green totem, so we'll just... We'll just grab blue. I need to get back to lane and not miss too much farm. We'll just wait for TP to come back up. Uh, might even, if it lines up, be able to upgrade it fully and also get tier 2 prophetic. That could be spicy. Okay, I'm a little bit low on mana here, but I should just be able to clear out the wave, no problem. Also, the lighting on my camera is so terrible right now, my apologies. I have like a blind on my window, because uh, I'm in the attic room at this place. I have like a blind on my window, uh, and if I don't close it during the day, uh, the lighting is terrible, because it just, it, this side of me is just uh, absolutely blinded. So apologies for that. But uh, I guess I'm looking like some kind of heavenly being right now. Which I mean, when do I not, but. I can really fight here, dude. I got a lot of mana back from Totem and Blue. Dude, you see how much healing I'm getting from that? Dude, maybe Lifesteal Totem on Arthur's actually lit. It was only, like, small amounts, but... It was a lot of small amounts. Since they added ability Lifesteal to it, maybe it's actually not that bad for Arthur's solo. Dude, imagine that Totem was Soul Eater and Jones, Vigor. That could be funny. Uh, yeah, dude, you're not getting this. Yeah, thank you. Can we kill, maybe? Do, the, do a bit of this, do a bit of spinning. Okay, no, we can't kill, but we've got some out. Oh, maybe we can, though. Now Chad's coming in. Get Sash. Oh, he missed the Sash, dude. That's unfortunate. Well, we still force him out. That's totally fine. How much is full Prophetic? We might just be a stay and get it, dude. 2350? Yeah, let's just stay. Oh my god, Arthur's won chunks, dude, once you get to max rank. Why is this Naja still here? I don't, I don't I don't know what he's doing other than leeching me, dude. Like, we're not gonna be a kill that shit, though. He's, he's, dude, is he gonna leave? I don't know what I guess maybe he was waiting for my blue to spawn. He didn't really have anything else to do on this side of the map. I, I don't know, to be honest.
Okay, he's coming back. Dude, I really don't need you to camp this lane, Ajar. Like, I'm, I'm okay. <laughs> I am three levels up. I think, I think I'm all right in this lane. You, you can go help elsewhere. I'll get that in a second. I want to contest this tone. Oh my god, I'm doing damage. We could probably kill, right? Oh, not if I miss my ult. I thought I'd have enough range there. That's a good note, though. If uh, Shiver's dash goes further than my ult. Okay, let's go grab my blue. Uh, I probably need to change the totem on, actually. We should have green totem by now. Okay, now Jazz going for it. I don't know if he has the damage. He's kind of completely oom. I got the blue, though. Oh, my... Dude, are you fucking kidding me? Why does that happen? Like, why does it teleport back to the camp when it's about to despawn? I just got absolutely trolled, dude. Could go grab his blue, but unfortunately you don't get the totem effect if you invade, which is another weird, like, thing about Smile. Like, why do you not get their totem effect? I understand not being able to change it, but you should be able to get their totem effect that they have selected, right? Smite just hates invades, unfortunately. I understand hating invades, especially level 1 invades, but, like, Smite hates invades too much, in my opinion. Dude, that tower's going down. I have six archers in there. Oh my god. Can we get this Bastion before it dies? Yes. Okay, actually, yeah. Is that gonna... There we go. Just chaos the tower from my minions. Hi, Shiva. I don't think he's realized uh, he can't knock me up in my spinnies. He keeps trying to use his uh, abilities to knock me up. Oh my god, let me use my things. Yeah, I mean, this lane's honestly kind of over at this point. I could, like, maybe stay a little bit longer to try and farm uh, some prophetic stacks on him. Until I get at least 15. But I probably don't even need 15, because I'll get a few physical ones over time just by rotating. But I need to start hitting the support mid with this prophetic. Oh, hello. Can I fight this? Oh, probably not. She's level 12, dude. Holy, how did she get so fed? Uh, I may be fucked here. I do have my ult, though. Oh. Thank you, Naja. Oh. Oh, my God. They're chasing me. Oh, dude. Uh, does he die? Maybe? Okay, Naja gets it, at least. Dude, they wanted me there. To be fair, I was way too pushed up. I was, like, really pressuring the shiver with no odds. I probably deserved that. Oh, you mean invading blue, yeah. yeah? an easier way to do this build would be uh, just pretty women uh, breastplate. But, unfortunately, you kind of need glad on King Arthur. So, I was like, I need another 10% item. Uh, I'm going to be a little bit less tanky with this build because of bauble. Let's just go for a prophetic. I'm not really stacking it super quick, but it's all right. I should probably start rotating now as well. I've got a big lead here and uh, the tower's down, so I don't really want to push too far up because, like, <laughs> they might gank me again like they just did. Team are winning the fights, though. Okay, are they fine there? I think they're fine. I'm going to try and steal this. Just get all of their farm. Okay, they, they actually kind of weren't fine. Maybe I should have rotated. Oh, we steal that at least. Oh, hello. Oh, no, dude. There we go. That should be a kill. Nice. Alright, with her dead, we can probably head back to solo, get a bit more farm. Get a few more prophetic stacks. Yeah, dude, I'm hella fed right now. I'm only 1-1-1, one, one, and one, but I've been dominating the lane so hard that, like, I'm just ridiculously fed. Ah, oh, he wants to... Ah, fine. I'll, I'll let him have it. Dude, 18 damage, not damage mitigation. Can we get this? Is this up? Yes. Mm, I'm not sure if I can get this, though. Don't think I really have the damage. What happens if I do this? 
Ah, uh, he gets it, okay. Good note, uh, don't use King Arthur ult to try and secure the scepter, it won't work. Kinda makes sense though, you slam them down first before you come back down. Okay, let's get full Prib win, let's start our bauble. And we'll probably start rotating with this TP, I think. Let's maybe go mid here. Mm, actually, maybe we can't really do a whole lot there. And they've warded as well. Hmm. Dan's just rotated, dude. Oh, okay, they are going in in mid. Let's rotate. Get served, maybe. Stun him. Ah, oh, dude, no, no follow-up really on my stuff. Oh, good freeze though, she's dead. Let's get gold, man. Bunch of map to back and uh, clean is dead, this should be free. For if this is her split pushing, so we will lose a tier one there, but we got a tier one in return and we're gonna get gold here, it's totally fine. I assume she's backed by now, right? Okay, I don't really have any kill potential on this shiver anymore. He's way too tanky for me. Dude, I'm fed right now though, dude. I have like, uh, almost 2k lead on this shiver. Okay, why is he cursing me? Is Cleaner coming? How much for bauble? Oh, we can buy it now. Yeah, let's just back, actually. I think Dajah's looking to kill the Shiver, but... Oh, dude, this guy's so annoying. Oh, maybe we can kill him, though. Ah, he does have that. Can't claim this here as well. Let's try and do a bit of this. Oh, dude, and Disco? Dude, the whole team's there. The, the whole team is actually here, even though ADC. Okay, Dajah, you're dead, bro. I'm sorry. I'm getting out. Dude, literally the whole team. Don't really want to back here because I can't TP straight back in. I want to kind of stick around. Maybe Stanza needs my help. Okay, I'll try him back now. Get the full bauble. Oh, I should have gone to the ward, actually. Ah, oh, then again, they're not really running away from my TP. Let's get in here, dude. They should have run away from my TP. Seen the damage I'm doing? Oh, it doesn't go through walls. Whoops. Where'd she go? She's probably in one of the walls, right? Ah, oh, there she is. Oh, dude, no one's here with me? That's unfortunate. That definitely should have been at least one kill. It's this goal as well. Team can get rotations here, dude. We can keep him in. Let's try and bait him. Nice, dude. That's one. That's two. Might not be able to get that guy. I'm a little bit low here. I'm gonna get some uh, E-set healing though. Yeah, nothing really happening there. Retreat. Yes. Are they trying to chase? They are trying to chase, dude. Let's try and get on this cleaner. Nice. Oh, can I get enough uh, for a big ult? Oh, dear. Well, that's a way to kill me. <laughs> Tower's kind of hurt. Yeah, let's go to mid tower here, try and get gold. This goes like hella low, dude. Is she coming in? Nah, she, she's 
Maybe we could assassinate her, though. Is she going to try and come in to defend? Cleaner's on speed as well. Oh, there she is. Another jump. There we go. That's a kill. Dude, that was hella greedy from her, this girl. They probably, like, knew we were on gold and she thought she was safe, but nah, I'm lurking, dude. Hi, clean it. Oh, nice spirit ball, dude. Good shit. Nice. Repair my slash line a little bit. I was 1, 2, and 6, dude. That is not, like, representative of the work I've been doing this game. I absolutely bodied my lane. I've just been tanking in these fights. Okay, Beacon's coming up. Let's grab that. Yeah, I'm not sure what I want to go last item. Probably just, uh, maybe a binding. Binding's always good on Arthur. Just give me a little bit more tankiness. But I uh, will probably be getting our blue stone before we do that. Hello, Charybdis. I mean, she has vision on me. Really? Oh, okay. <laughs> Unfortunate you mail wall. Does the trick, though. I was looking to kill. Okay, I kind of want to hit 20 before I back here, honestly. Is this up? No. Maybe try and kill in mid. Cerberus just backed. Oh, dude. I thought I had my uh, ult. I just used it. <laughs> oh, dude. An actually effective Charybdis ult. That's like the first one I've ever seen. Okay. Dude. No DR. You may freeze. Absolutely chunks. Yeah, I could probably go in here, dude. Oh, okay. 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 Attacking a little bit too much at this hour, that. I'll grab that. Yeah, I'm just gonna back here and get my blue stone. Assuming they are fine, which they should be. Oh my god, the Cerberus never gives up the chase. I need to just TP in here. Maybe we got this ward, actually, because they might be trying to gank the Naja. Or we could just, like... Oh, good dude, he's getting solo. Should be able to clean this up, though. Nice. I am probably getting rotated on here, though, because they were all mid. Yeah. I mean, I could, I could kill this cleaner, but I don't know if anyone else is rotating. Looks like no. Let's just steal our back camps. Yeah, I'm, I had to break it to you, Cleaner. I, I won this 1v1. I, I wouldn't recommend it. Yeah, I did. <laughs> you, you don't take that 1v1. Are these the kind of people that complain about tanks? Like, just learn when you cannot take a 1v1. I uh, cannot quite get full binding, so I guess we'll just rotate mid here. We should probably just do fire, honestly. I feel like Fire is just a play. I mean, if we want, we could try and siege. Thing is, they're all respawning. It's only a 4v4. It's not actually that great for sieging. Oh, dude, never mind. We absolutely shred that Phoenix. Well, we shredded it and then kind of gave up, apparently. There we go. Yeah. Kind of want to get out here, to be honest. I do feel like fire still would have been better for us there, but... Retreat. Yeah, I do kind of want to get out and just TP back in with Binding if they're going to chess. <laughs> really? Dude, this Cerberus is so annoying. <laughs> this never lets me back. Okay, unfortunately, Dan's I got picked. Alright, let's go to this ward here. Get full Binding. Alright, that's the build done. Uh, other than we need um, three more magical prophetic stacks. Can we gank the Disco? Yeah, surely, right? Oh, dude. Tip a range. That is a dead disco. Retreat? Are you kidding me, dude? You see how much we're dominating? Why would we retreat here? If we wanted to, we could probably end the game here. Because we're going to get, um... Wait, did we not get cleaner? Oh, I should probably went into a wall, right? 
Might as well do gold, I guess. Oh, they're still going after the cleaner. We got it? Nice. Let's get gold. Yeah, let's just get gold and then get fire, man. Like, we have uh, fire waves pushing in on both uh, mid and right. Probably got all the pressure for him. Press for counter wall, bro. Oh, does he may not know he can drop his wall? I feel like me and Dadza could probably just start fire here. Like, we have so much pressure, dude. They don't have to deal with all the waves. Dadza doesn't want to do it, though. Okay, Nachas here as well. Dude, I'm doing so much damage right now. Like, I'm not even a damage build. I guess the bauble's giving me a little bit of extra power, right? Yeah, I feel like we could probably just start this. Oh my god, the lunges messed me up there. <laughs> yeah, we shred this thing. Okay, I need to find Cerberus and Discordia and get my two mob effect stacks, dude. Oh, hello. Oh my god, they're all there. Oh, okay, let's just ult to buy some time. <laughs> I thought it was just clean, and I just blinked into four people. I don't think it matters, though. Like, I, I am King Arthur with 50% cooldown. What do you do, really? I'm still so tanky as well. Dude, can I get another... I can get another roll off here, right? Yeah, dude. Two ults in, like, how many seconds? I'll put it up on screen in the post-editing. Dude, that was that felt like 10 seconds or something between ults. Nice, dude. Feels good to play some King Arthur again. I haven't played him in a while. The bobble build is hilarious as well. Can we get this? Stun? Oh, dude, it's Charybdis. I forgot. Yeah, it should be GG, though. Farm some damage. Nice. GG's, dude. GG's. Oh, yeah, dude. 35k with that build. Holy shit. That is some damage right there. We got an invite from the Danza because I hard carried him. Uh, I'm not sure I'm playing another one, so unfortunately, I will have to decline that. Yeah, dude. Look at those numbers. 36 and 51 on Tick and a mitigate. 35k damage dealt. Dude, we farmed that game. But yeah, hopefully you guys enjoyed that one. Uh, a few people have been requesting King Arthur. He's obviously uh, one of my mains. Uh, you could argue just straight up my main, but I, I play a lot of characters. But yeah, he's one of my mains. 50% uh, cooldown build is obviously really good for him. And yeah, I will catch you guys in another one tomorrow on Into Games. Peace.